And there is a look at our next team from Ukraine. 17-year-old Mira Pinchuk and 21-year-old Mikita Pogorilov. In character, right off the start, 63.17 personal best, 60.63 is their season's best, earning that in Istanbul, where they won that event. They'll skate to Unchained, Unchained My Heart, and you give me love, a bad name. Maria Pinchuk and Mikita Pogorli of the winners in Istanbul and Turkey vying not just to get to the Junior Grand Prix final but hoping to contend with Derek Graham and Mikhail Sabitsky who lead already and I asked the team you know what, what's happened since the last event and they just said how grateful they are to the Austrian Federation for yeah. giving them the opportunities to train. Yeah they talked about that in their interview last week and uh, I thought that was very nice. They wanted to make sure that they thank the Austrian Federation for all the support they've given. They wouldn't be skating here. They wouldn't be in the Junior Grand Prix without that and so that was a very center on their mind and they wanted mm. to make sure they mentioned which they did in that interview. And uh, Galina who's responsible and has been responsible, as I said, for so many Ukrainian teams and also working with a former student of hers, Maxim Nikitin, who has been with them over the last couple of weeks. He was a junior world medalist. Nice to see that lineage of coaches as we look through the draws. Just a little gappy here, so not optimal grade of execution on that as we look at the Rocker Foxtrot. And this team, like the Germans who just competed, having seven out of the eight key points. So the technical panel looking at this, the outside closed Mohawk. On the back inside edge and looking stronger as we see this couple's getting to grips in terms with the key points as the season progresses here. The non-touch, they're an outside swing chock top. They're allowed to stop within this element. Can't be for longer than five seconds though. And such a different approach to the Germans, such a different style and vibe choice and that's something that we're also appreciative of. Now this, the rotation lift, they had a 
a one-point deduction for this in their first Junior Grand Prix in Istanbul. It was extended lift, so it was over the seven-second marker. So they've had to go back to their training base now in Vienna and ensure that that's... So the end of that lift, or it lifts, if they touch down, they don't have to set them down. But as long as that foot touches down, that's the end of the that's, lift. So that has to be, the first touchdown has to be within seven seconds. Then what's happening after that, they're using that as a feature, as a difficult exit. Oh, okay, got it. So, but it, that doesn't count towards the total length of time in the lift no, itself. No, no, but as soon as that touchdown does, that's the end of the, the lift clock. or whatever they do. Okay, yeah, got it. Stop. I always wondered about that. Oh, you know what? It just... It just came up again. Extended lift. They've had it again. Oh, oh man. boy. Too bad. <laughs> Sorry, team. Well, their personal best, 63.17. They're going to fall just a bit shy of that here. And But it's a season's best of 62.23. So that'll put Maria and Makita currently into second place. But pretty close. Just about three points. We saw a big six-point swing last week. Yeah.